So we swell. The first one of them is we swell up. And then we get down, uh, and then we three, and then we count seven. Yeah. And then the ending is. So cat club, you guys. Yeah, cat club. Yeah. yeah. You going over the set list? Oh uh, yeah, we are. Yeah, yeah. Just, a, just kind of a change in the song a little bit, just for this live show. Yeah. It's gonna be a really sweet show. How long is the set? 45 minutes. Yeah, 45 minutes. Of blistering rock and roll. Yeah, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be hot up there, but it's always fun on the stage. Yeah. It'll be really fun here. So most kids that are 14 years old, right, on a Friday night, aren't typically yeah. hanging out on the Sunset Strip at a, at a no, bar. Usually probably at like the mall or something. Right. <laughs> Do you ever worry about, you know, that in, in some way that you're missing out somehow on, on a typical teenage upbringing? Um, never actually. What are some of your friends that aren't in a, a rock band doing tonight? Probably at home watching TV and just uh, doing homework when we're not rocking, I guess. Mm -hmm. You're 13 years old. <laughs> um, this is kind of strange. Uh, you could say that. Yeah. <laughs> Do you remember the first piece of music that you ever purchased? Yourself um, with your own money? I, th um, I don't know, it might have been Abbey Road, I think. Or Sergeant Pepper. Or Beatles. It was a Beatles record. Zach, do you remember? I think I was when I was uh, younger, I used to be a really big fan of The Killers. Mm -hmm. So probably like back then, I don't know if it was like Sam's Town or something, but I used to like them a lot. So Dave, did, did you volunteer for this, or did, did, did the other parents appoint you as kind of the, uh, uh, the, I kinda the road just manager? Volunteer. Yeah. I just figure, you know, I've been doing it for quite a while, so I'll keep doing it for the kids. That's all. So you, you you set up all the gear. Uh, well, it's kind of shared. Uh, Dylan's dad, Craig, does some stuff, mm -hmm. but uh, I have no problem doing it. Stick the PA up or the keyboards, amps. Yeah. Are you are you gonna miss this? That once they actually are able to pay somebody to do this? Uh, yeah, I probably will. Maybe I'll let him at least let me play tambourine in the back or right. the curtain or something. Right. Get some points on the record. Yeah, something. <laughs> So as part of your gig tonight, do you guys play any covers? Yes, we're doing a Led Zeppelin cover called The Rose Girl, a physical graffiti. Mm -hmm. We're doing a Strokes cover called Last Night off their debut album, Is This It? And we're doing a Jimi Hendrix cover, Foxy Lady. That's it, if you cool. show up with the middle. Do you guys know a lot of covers? Um, yes, we know tons of covers, way more than originals. We probably know 50 covers. Yeah. Really? <laughs> What do you think of your, your younger brother being a, a potential rock star? More musically talented than I am. <laughs> yeah. He's amazing, yeah. He's really good. Yeah, you think it's strange that uh, that a 13 or 14 year old is out on Sunset Strip um, on a Friday night? Um, no, I think it's pretty cool. Yeah. I mean, you kind of learn a lot from all the people passing by, so I think it's kind of cool. I've been doing this for probably since I was around 12 or 13 now. like. When I was with the program, like joined the band and some other programs, they'd always play at like the Whiskey or something. Mm -hmm. So I think we all got kind of early exposure to this, which is really cool. Mm -hmm. Five dollar off coupon. So with the, with the five dollars off, adults get in free. Kids are five dollars. So I'm gonna Xerox about fifty of these. <laughs> make, a few, make a few bucks tonight. <laughs>